Welcome to Embedded World 2013 in Nuremberg and welcome to the stand of MSC Embedded. My name is Peter Eckermann and I would like to present the latest highlights that we show on the Embedded World for the first time. On my right hand side you can see the NanoRisk family of embedded computing modules based on microcontrollers from the ARM family. In that case we are presenting our latest module based on the Texas Instruments AM335X, which is a Cortex A8 processor starting at 300 megahertz. And there are versions based on a processor with 800 megahertz, which soon will also be augmented to one gigahertz. The module is equipped with up to 512 megabytes of DRAM and up to 512 megabytes of NAND flash single level cell because the module is optionally available in the full industrial temperature range or else in the standard commodity temperature range 0 to 70 degrees Celsius. The NanoRisk standard is offering a large number of embedded interfaces which are implemented on the MXM connector here on the lower side of the module and the connector to be used on the baseboard is the MXM230 connector which is also used on notebooks to hold the additional graphics cards used sometimes in laptop computers. Hence this is a very inexpensive connector available from many suppliers in the world. But we are also offering a suitable baseboard, the MB2, to be used for the aviation of NanoRisk modules. Next to the NanoRisk AM335 X module, there is low-end module S3C2416 based on an R9 processor which forms the low end of the NanoRisk product family. And the high end is currently represented by the NanoRisk module S5PV210 which is using a Cortex-A8 processor, single core, clocked at between 800 MHz and 1 GHz, which offers exceptional graphics features and can drive an external HDMI screen up to full HD video resolution. NanoRisk modules are relatively small and compact, and they allow the realization of very compact systems uh, because of their low power consumption, they can also be used in mobile, portable, battery-powered uh, applications and normally do not require any cooling because power consumption is between 2.0 and 2.5 watts in general. Target applications for NanoRisk modules are in the range of general automation, measurement technology, but also in point of sales and point of information applications because of the inherent good graphics performance, even large screens can be driven directly from the modules. Other applications are medical, point of information, digital signage and general embedded application which will make use of the very many useful embedded interfaces that are offered by the NanoRisk module standard.